Hey guys, it's Barbara Jean with Really Special Animals, and we're going to mix up some fat balls. What we're going to do is we're going to take a bunch of fatty hamburger with bananas, mackerel, sardines, eggs, peanut butter, molasses, honey, olive oil, oats, total cereal. We're going to mix that all up. And we're going to make it into pretty much little meatballs. And we're going to give it to this girl, Dolly. Get her fatten up a little bit. Because all of this, all these ingredients are pretty oily and high in fat, uh, these fat balls put on, put weight on dogs pretty quickly. And she's a little skinny mini. So, we are going to make these. And then we're going to give them to Dolly, who is available for adoption. Good girl. We are just mixing up all those ingredients in uh, to make our fat balls. So as you can see, it's all in here. And it gets kind of tough to do it with a spoon, so I'm actually just going to use my hands, which is a lot different, but it's more effective, I think. Plus it gets your scent in there. So we got, let's see, we got hamburger, we have peanut butter, molasses, honey, bananas, there's sardines in here, which kind of gross me out. Dogs love them. And I'm just mixing this all around. And what we're going to end up doing is we're going to take a little handful and then we're going to make it into a little ball. Like so. And that's your fat ball. You actually put this in the freezer and you feed it to the dog raw. That's right, raw. You do not have to cook this. In fact, if you do cook it, you will be losing a ton of nutritional value and you're pretty much defeating the whole purpose of doing this to begin with. So, you just mix it all up in your bowl. Put this aside. Grab a handful make into little meatballs or what I call fat balls and there it is that is your fat ball so you can make them in different sizes depending on how big your dog is and how slowly you want to introduce it to them my uh, pity has a very sensitive stomach so he actually started off only licking the spoon when we first made these and um, over time, we were able to increase his uh, tolerance of it because it is so much that uh, sometimes it's a lot for them to take in at once. So, um, what I'll do next is I'll get some Ziploc bags out and some wax paper, and I'm just going to line up all my fat balls, and I'll put them in the freezer until they're ready to be eaten. and. Sometimes I'll give them to them just straight frozen, sometimes I'll thaw it out, but uh, the point, the most important point is to not cook them, alright? Um, and in case you're wondering with the eggs, I did use the shells also, so everything is all natural, the whole thing, they get it all. Sardines, the little bones are in there, that's fine. Um, Bananas, eggs, peanut butter, molasses, honey, olive oil, total cereal, steel cut oats, fatty, fatty hamburger, uh, macro, the whole nine yards. Now, a lot of people don't put all these extra stuff in there. You can Google satin balls is what most people call them. And uh, you can get a bunch of different recipes. There's no really right or wrong way of doing it, but this is how we like to do it here at RSA. So, just wanted to share.
we are back with the final product. Ta-da! Now, a few things. Notice that the fat balls in this bag are a lot bigger than the ones in this bag. So we're going to start here. One, two, three, four. So we're gradually going to get bigger and bigger very slowly. Only probably one meatball a day. Um, as long as your dog can tolerate it. But the thing is, you have to go super slow because all this stuff is in it and a lot of our dogs aren't used to all this stuff. So, and it is raw, so we don't want them to explode out the other end if they're not used to getting food in the raw form either. So, Dolly's literally gonna start off licking the bowl. She's not even gonna have this meatball. That meatball's for Kane. But, um, how much did I use to make all this stuff? Uh, let's see, I used about three and a half pounds of hamburger, half a bag of total cereal, half a thing of oats. I didn't use the mackerel in this batch because I used the sardines, so that'll be in the second batch. Um, little, no, I don't know how much olive oil, one of these amount of olive oil, a gigantic scoop of peanut butter, gigantic. This was full when we started of honey. This was full when we started of molasses. Did one and a half bananas and three eggs with the shell. Okay, you got to get all the nutrients in there. Again, this is not cooked, so these bags are literally going to go straight into the freezer and come out as needed. Remember to start with the small balls first, maybe one meatball a day. Okay guys, our fat balls are in the freezer, ready to go. Miss Dolly is waiting patiently. Remember, these are full of fat and not a meal replacement, but something to add to the meal to put weight on your dog fast. I hope this helps some of those skinny minis out there. Enjoy.